Hello, hello, and welcome back to our episode, episode 43. And last episode, we reforged our items to like the best stuff ever, and it's really strong and powerful and stuff. And uh, last episode, also, the, uh, the pirates were arriving from the west. What is this golden chandelier? Cool. So, never eat shredded wheat. So, they're coming from the left. Oh, wait, no, they're on the right. Okay, they're coming from the. Never eat. They're coming from the east, not the west. Okay, yeah, but like I was saying, the pirates were coming. And now, we will finally fight the pirates. And I know the pirate captain dropped some epic loot. So I can't wait to fight him. And obviously, with this gear that we have and the weapons we have, we're going to fight. We're going to kill him easily. So, uh, can't wait for that. Oh, I was, yeah, I was about to ask if they could uh, open my uh, doors. But apparently, they can't, which is awesome. And yeah, it looks like most of them are coming from that side. So we will go ahead. Oh, my God, the weapons are strong. Oh, it's, it's, the, it's the captain. It's the captain. There he is. Just as I was saying it. Oh, my God. He's insane. He is insane. We got five gold coins from him. Sick. Okay. No, please leave me alone. Okay. Yeah. And uh, wait. Before we do anything, right? Let me just get one, two, three, four, five. There we go. And we'll throw the rest away just because this was used for the reforging. And I don't want to cheat. So uh, there we go. All right. We need some health desperately. Looks like they're all on fire over there. Cool stuff. Good job, Imp. You are doing a very good job at keeping them at bay. Okay, here we go. We d I use these for defense against bosses and to get health back. And then now I'm using them against the pirate army because it's so insanely strong. Okay, you know what? We okay, we're going to fight fire with fire. We're going to use our unreal mega is shock on these guys and i haven't actually seen the comments from the previous episode so i don't know what the best weapon or the best bullets are for these guys so yeah sorry about that guys oh my god these guys are insane holy crap Okay, little pirates. How am I supposed to fight the planter if I can't even kill the pirates without dying at least once? I know I'm gonna die once. So, uh, yeah, okay, okay, where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Okay, the pirate cap, the captain is the one that does the damage. No, 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 I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die. Okay, there we go. Oh my god, okay, okay, now we, now, now it's, I don't even know what to do. I honestly don't know what to do. Okay, there we go. At least we're safe inside our house. Our house is finally a place for us to be safe and not worry about anyone coming inside. So. Let's go ahead and take our good healing potions and put them to good use. Okay, now we just wait, I guess. Okay, you know what? We'll use our trap. Boom. <laughs> I don't know. It's just so funny using the trap like that. Okay, the pirate captain is right there. So we can. We will be able to kill him easily. There we go. Dead. We got a terrible cutler. 62. Oh my gosh. See, I would use this, right? It's fast speed, but this is very fast speed. And although this might do a bit more damage if I, you know, reforge it and stuff, because this is reforged the best. If I reforge this and it does incredibly, like much like 75, I'd say 75 damage, it's still a lot slower. It has worse knockback. And also, it doesn't shoot a beam of light. So right now, I'm going to stick with my beam sword no matter what, unless I get a much better sword than that. Mainly because it's a lot better. So um, yeah, let's drink that. Here we go. And let's go ahead and start fighting these guys. See, it's easy fighting them. It's easy killing them. But the pirate captain, now that's another story because he is insane. He does so much damage and stuff and just wrecks me so hard. Okay, now you guys will have to uh, be dead. Okay, gosh, no, stop, stop, stop. Okay, it's a pirate captain, pirate captain. Yes, he does the most damage. I want his gun. Whatever gun he has is insane. It does so much more damage than mine. And I got like 61 defense. I don't know how he does that much damage. Obviously, it's his gun, but I don't know what it is. I want to send another pirate captain. Please drop your gun and I would be happy. No, he dropped five gold coins though. Let's see how much we have so far. Uh, 19, awesome stuff. And that's just from the pirate invasion, which is insane. So, uh, yeah. Okay, guys, please leave me alone for a bit. Okay, drink that. There we go. All right, and next episode, I guess we can do, you know, a, a potion episode where we just make some really good potions to fight against the bosses. So, uh... There's that, because right now we're running out. We don't have any greater healing potions except the 13 that's in my inventory. I know I can just kill bosses to get them, but I'm pretty sure it's easier to make them. I think, I'm not actually sure. Maybe it is easier to kill bosses to get them. We'll see. Whatever the case is, that's what we'll do. Whichever one's easier for us. Okay, please stop. Please. Oh my god, his knockback is crazy. Please stop. this, <laughs> Dude. Thank you. Okay. Now that we have an understanding, let me kill you all and uh, I'll let you go, okay? Because right now you guys are getting destroyed and it's only your captain that's keeping you alive. So if you guys cooperate a little bit with me, I will be lenient with you and... Uh 
and kill you quickly instead of slowly. And the pirates have been defeated. Awesome stuff. Okay, now what did we get from that? We got a cutlass, so that's not bad. And we got a golden door. Ooh, fancy. All right, I'm sure there's a few stragglers behind of the pirates. So I guess we can go ahead and finish them off. But for now, I know you guys are, 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 are um, don't like me doing only like uh, like six, seven minute episodes. I know you guys hate that. So I'll try my best and do them at least 10 minutes each. So uh, yeah, but now, you know what? We, we're going to give our NPC house a little bit of a makeover and make it a lot nicer than before. I think this is in the middle here. Boom, there we... Ooh, fancy. Aren't you guys just so happy? I can tell you guys are happy. Look at that. Look at their faces. They, they're all smiling inside and stuff okay um so that's that and uh we'll also give them a fancy door as well and if you're wondering why why do they deserve it after they have just been mistreating me and not making me one of their own well that's a very good question because i have no idea what i just said but yeah the terrible cutlass we will keep in here for now just because i'm not gonna use it it's, it's gonna do more damage maybe 75 but because it's slower it's technically doing less damage every minute than the beam sword that i have now which is insane very fast speed not insane i wish it was insane imagine getting insane that would be insane okay now you guys don't worry you're gonna get a secondary makeover look you can hear their screams of excitement or boredom i don't know i can't tell the difference but look at this you guys get a fancy golden door oh my god now they're all gonna line up and give me cheap prices on everything oh you know what maybe one episode we can make uh mine carts and stuff you know just going across and, and whatever so yeah that wouldn't be too bad either okay so now what do we have in our inventory absolutely nothing so let's go ahead one thing i did want to do right is explore the jungle and the reason for that is because i know i can spawn the plantera so i'm gonna be careful i know the plantera bulbs are the one that spawn the plantera so i'm gonna be careful and try not to break them otherwise i'm screwed and i'm losing oh you know what let's put our money back before we do anything put the money back where we got it from because i don't want to be dealing with all this stuff okay 23 gold not bad at all if we had a pirate map that wouldn't be bad because then we can just keep on spawning the pirates in order to get money because they, they they give some good amount of money oh and there's a giant tortoise brat what are you doing please stop you know what you're no match for me anymore you're rubbish even you dumpling you guys suck all of you, you just please go away stop and uh, yeah, look at that. They can't kill me anymore. <laughs> Remember when I was when I was younger, and uh, we we played in the early days of Terraria, and I sucked. And uh, basically, what happened was I continuously got killed by pretty much everything around me. And now I'm the one doing the killing, which is cool. All right, toxic sludge, go away. Now let's see what's new in the jungle, right? And. Uh, we are we need you know what if we there it is that's the plantera spawner right there i don't want to break it i'm gonna get scared if i do okay now one thing i want to see right is do we have any areas in this place where it's like a huge open area because if not then i'm gonna go ahead and make one so yeah it doesn't oh actually we do down right there okay so how do we get down there okay we just follow it okay we go down from here okay because in an open area it's the best place to uh, fight the plantera because if you're stuck in one area which is really small then she's gonna continuously hit you and you're gonna die there's no way you're gonna survive it yo is this the area yes it is so i'm gonna go ahead and open it a little bit is it the area that's the question oh it's not okay yeah i was confused because it was a little bit smaller than it was on the map okay it's down here okay now this is what i'm talking about when i say open spaces oh my gosh it's amazing okay so let's just uh, fix it a little bit just so it's a lot nicer and easier to maneuver and stuff and uh, a lot smoother on the sides and whatever so uh, yeah here we go please leave me alone be be thank you so much all right so also what we're going to be doing is uh, fixing getting rid of the water so then when we do fight the plantera it's uh it's not gonna get in our way and we're not gonna get stuck in it or anything like that so uh, let's go ahead and do that right there okay please leave me alone thank you all right and i'm gonna break this just in case i get stuck in this area i don't want to be stuck forever and i want to be able to fly out straight ahead so uh oh my god i literally almost broke it i i got so scared <laughs> oh my god it's right there that's good that it's right there because that means I'm going to be able to kill it and uh, just break it and then be able to fly in this area. Okay, I actually got so scared right there. Okay, let's hopefully not break it. Alright, there we go. It's right on the edge. Oh my god. Oh my- Oh my god! 
Oh gosh, oh gosh, please don't. I don't Imagine if that is not even the spawner. That's gonna be so embarrassing for me, but I'm pretty sure. <gasps> Did we spawn it? No, it's not. Oh my god, thank you. Okay, that is not the spawner. Okay, you know what? I, I was being dumb, and remember when I said it's gonna be embarrassing? That was pretty embarrassing. Oh, okay, so I just looked it up, and I wasn't being dumb. I mean, it was a little bit embarrassing, but I'm not being dumb. Basically, it is those green things, but it's actually a pink color, the ones that spawn the Plantera. So, uh, technically, I was correct in saying that is the Plantera spawner, but it's just, it wasn't pink. It was just the wrong color. I mean, the game messed me up. So, I mean, it was the same shape, though. Anything like that, but it's pink, that's basically the Plantera spawner. So, uh... Yeah, let's not let's not break that by accident. <laughs> you know what's funny? Once you get used to the speed of your pickaxe or whatever, it just becomes slow afterwards. I mean, this is so slow mining this stuff. I mean, I know it's a really fast one, and I know what I had before, and I know it was a lot worse. But this is pretty slow. I'm not gonna lie. Wild Beza. Oh, what did we get? What is that? Oh, what? oh, we have this. Come on, man. All right, there we go. And there is our arena. I know there's chlorophyte up there. I just wanted to spread a bit more. But this is our arena. I blocked it off in many areas. I'm going to fix it up a bit off screen as well. But yeah, I blocked this off down here so I don't fall down and not be able to get back up. I will mine these out as well a little bit. Why not? Because it, can, it will help us, you know, more space. Obviously, a lot better. So, um, yeah, basically, if you want to fight the Plantera, do it in a big box like this. So, yeah. Anyway, guys, hope you guys have enjoyed the episode. My Perfect Lion, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.